And now, KITV4 Weather. Welcome to Weather Now. We're dealing with a few more showers out there to start off the work week, mainly for the Central Islands making its way over to Kauai. Our rain gauges, here's what we picked up. The top has been a little bit more than half an inch for Pu'ukukui, a little bit more than a third for Mwanalua, as well as Waikia Uka on the island of Hawaii, and just shy of a quarter for Mount Waialeale. All of these totals as of 5 a.m. this morning over the last 12 hours. Now, for our rain forecast, which you can track anytime online, showing a batch of showers over the state that starts to dry up into Tuesday, mainly for the northern end as well. And on the lighter side, though, we may get some moderately intense showers. You do want to keep the rain gear handy for the day. Umbrella jacket, it is going to kind of come and go more active in the early morning as it usually is. Now, here's a picture of the south facing shore sent in by Wayne Kamisato over the weekend. And today, pretty much consistent to what we had then. Two to four for the south, one to three for the east. We are looking forward to a moderate size south to southwesterly swell going to start filling in Wednesday. And then possibly Thursday, Friday, we could get high surf criteria for this one. So keep posted with that. High tide in the 10 o'clock hour, 1.9, and then going down at 0.7 in the 6 o'clock hour. Mariners, uh, no marine warnings. We have wind waves up to 8 feet east northeasterly, not staying consistent at 20, and really no swell at this time. But again, we are expecting that southerly one coming in a little bit later. Sundown, 701, checking out today's conditions. UV index remains at extreme. East northeasterly trades are going to hang out on the lighter side, so that is going to make our high of 89 in the 1 o'clock hour definitely feel warmer in Honolulu as far as our island by island forecast. Kauai is probably going to hang on to the most cloud coverage today. Those showers most active in the morning hours going to ease off into the afternoon. 84, the high for Kane Ohe Marine Corps Base as well as Wai Manalo. And then our trades, generally 10 to 15, some areas may get up to 20 miles per hour sustained. And then the island of Hawaii on the east side could get gusts up to 30 miles per hour. Light and variables continue for the Kona side with a high of 82 for Waikoloa. Now, as we head into the next eight days, we're really not going to deal with much in the way of changes other than the fact that uh, the cloud coverage that we're expecting today eases off tomorrow along with drier conditions, light to moderate trades will continue. And look at our temperatures. Could reach near 90. So do what you can to stay cool. Hit the beach. Keep on the AC. We'll have more details tomorrow.